Frank Mora is a chef, author, and owner of Spanish restaurant Mavida. Today, he's sharing his kitchen with two Michelin star chef and international ambassador for olive oils from Spain, Diego Guerrero. Together, they're creating a couple of the freshest recipes that come straight from the heart and feature one of our favorite ingredients, the world's best olive oils from Spain. Today, they're combining the freshest of flavors in creating calamari with spiced beetroot salad. What really makes this, this pop is the, the use of the fresh olive oil from Spain. Exactly, just yeah. brings those flavors together. So let's get started with the beetroot salad. Let's go for it. I want to roast some beetroot. I'm going to wrap them in some oil okay. alongside onions and garlic. This is my favourite way of cooking beetroots because it intensifies the flavour compared to boiling them in water. A couple of onions and I'm going to cook those still in their skin. Let's get this in the oven for about 40 minutes and then I'll take out the onions and the garlic and leave the beetroots in for longer. Well, Frank, while you do this, I get ready the seeds. Ah, oh, perfect. Oh. Do you want to grab a lemon? Sure. You start the dressing. Okay. Squeeze in the juice of one lemon. Pop in white wine vinegar, a bit of salt, and the perfect emulsifier, the Spanish olive oil. Olive oil from Spain makes such a difference because they harvest the olives and they press immediately. Fantastic. Its freshness and quality make the olive oil from Spain the best olive oil in the world. Beautiful. Okay, taste, please. That's sensational. Yeah. Beautiful, balanced. Yum. Thank you. The beetroots have just come out of the oven, and I'm going to slice these into strips. Beetroot works really well with the calamari. So now I'm going to deal with the onions and the garlic. I just cut the end off and squeeze out all that beautiful, juicy, caramelised onion flavour. Now the garlic. Squeeze it all out. All that beautiful garlic paste. We're going to slice the onions just roughly. Well, now it's time for the seeds. Yep. Mmm. That smells awesome. Yeah. Let's put the dressing in. A little bit of mint. Pinch of salt and salad's ready to go and we can look at the calamari. Okay, let's go for it. Cut them through the middle so they fit into the pan. Some garlic. Please? Yes, <laughs> through the middle. Very simple. So we are going to fry it? Yeah, okay. with a good amount of olive oil. The best olive oil to fry is the piquoil because it reaches 180 degrees without losing the aromas and all the quality. Right. And as you know, it's the healthiest fat in the world. It's good for the heart, good for the cholesterol, the well balance. I eat two tablespoons of olive oil every day. Is that why you always look so young? I look younger than you. <laughs> yes, you do. A little bit of salt. Put on. the cover on. Yeah. How many times? About five minutes. Five Just minutes. low to medium temperature, cook it slowly, okay. and then we can turn it over. Okay. That. Look at that. It's beautiful. It smells amazing. Yeah, it's finished. Let's go. Okay, I'm going to cut. Can't wait to eat it. Let's put this together in a beautiful beetroot salad. Do you mind if I take a little bit of that gorgeous sauce okay. as well? That's where the flavour is, all those juices from the calamari yeah. and the beautiful Let Spanish olive oil. And there we have it. Calamari cooked in Spanish olive oil, beautiful beetroot salad. That is a masterpiece. Ah, thanks, Diego. If you want to follow the recipe step by step, you'll be able to find it on tasteourlifestyle.com.au. That's beautiful. Thank you, Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you.